It's come down to a battle of attrition right now. And a bit of a test of strength there. Beautiful neck breaker. And chin lock, and now just rapid fire punches. Now look at aggression, just pure brutality. On easy. Randy Orton is one of the most dominant competitors in WWE history with few weaknesses. Corey, how would you target the Apex Predator? One needs to look at Orton's medical history for the key. More than anything else, shoulder injuries would put the Viper on the side of it. Oh, man, right to the arm. Viper extends your elbow. Corey brought up Orton's many shoulder injuries earlier, and my quick research corroborates that. He suffered one just six months into his career and has been out of action as recently as 2016 due to shoulder issues. Well, even if you don't re-injure the Apex Predator's shoulder, it's still smart to target it as you'll drastically reduce the effectiveness of his RKO. Looks like Randy Orton has broken a sweat. He's going to want to make sure this doesn't swing well out of control. Yeah, he's taking on some offense here. That's to be expected, especially considering who he's in the ring with. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. John Cena is measuring. He'd be wise to stay right there. John Cena is one of the greatest in-ring performers in WWE history, but he's no slouch on the microphone either. Whether he's rapping insults or dealing out harsh truths, Cena can be an intimidating presence when he speaks to the WWE Universe. Byron, you spoke before about John Cena's verbal acumen matching his wrestling skills, and we've seen that in practice a lot lately. His in-ring battle with Roman Reigns was accentuated by Cena shooting straight about Reigns' failings. Gentlemen, I think the biggest feather in Cena's speaking cap is that he got the WWE Universe to boo The Undertaker by repeatedly calling out the dead man ahead of WrestleMania. Now that is... And it's Randy Orton able to stop the count. Too soon. Back in from the apron. Oh, what incredible power. Wow, what a vertical suplex. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. For someone to survive a battle against Randy Orton, two things are critical. And here comes Randy Orton. This might not have been a wise move for him here, Michael. He forces his way free. Man, he just has so much resolve.
The apex predator is so dangerous in so many ways that what you said earlier, Corey, is more than accurate. Randy Orton can slither his way into an opponent's mind and then end it all with one RKO. Randy Orton does unbelievable things when he hears the voices in his head. The Viper's opponents must try to escape the psychological torture and at all costs stay far away from the RKO. The WWE has many defined eras and athletes who were the face of the company during that time. Red Hart during the new generation, Steve Austin in the Attitude Era. The current era, however, is all John Cena's. He truly is the face of this company. Well, you call John Cena the face of the WWE, and I don't think anyone can doubt that. He's got a record number of world titles and has main evented some of the biggest WrestleManias in history. And he doesn't stay down for long. I have to put in a little more work than that. needs to rally quick. I mean, it looks trying. He's got to be running on empty at this point. I don't know where he's finding the strength to stay in this one. Success breeds success. Nice. And he's definitely having some right now. On, he dodges out of the way. Ooh, John Cena may have it. Smith. The Viper getting absent. Wow, I can't believe he had the energy to kick out of that. I don't believe it. He refuses to lose. I don't think he can take any more. I'm not giving up on the conversation about John Cena. That phrase, never give up, has inspired so many of Cena's fans. Terminally ill children, members of the military, Cena fights hard so that they can fight even harder. Yeah, you have to be inspired by a guy with Cena's work ethic. He's fighting harder now than he was when he was a rookie. Nobody can doubt Cena when he utters those three words. Fireman's carry. This doesn't look good, Corey. Couldn't agree more, Cole. This has got trouble written all over it. He's always had great stamina. See if it lasts here. He's fighting from underneath, and he manages to get the shoulder up. He's showing the heart of a warrior here tonight. Randy Orton. And there it is, boys. Well, John Cena's in a real bad spot. One. Two! And the shoulder gets up in time. Still too fresh. John Cena's WWE career began in 2002, and his first victory was over Y2J Chris Jericho. Cena back then was filled with... It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. What a stomp! Good grief! Corey, in the beginning of John Cena's career, the rookie was among the legends of the ring. Cena became U.S. champion and defeated my former broadcast colleague, JBL, at WrestleMania 21. And he got a near fall out of it. Wow. I thought for sure that was it. Oh, no. Looking a little out of it up on that turnbuckle. Oh, this could very well be the beginning of the end. He's fighting from underneath. 